Come on. <laughs> so coming up next, we are going to have the other side of the losers bracket. This is one R Kappa Mise going up against Razor's infiltration. One of these two players is going home after this. That's right. You know it's going to be Makoto for Misei. I briefly spoke with Misei before this thing started, mm -hmm. and he said that this is not going to be an easy one for him. He's expecting Elena or DiCaprio okay. out of Infiltration, and he's really worried about both of those characters. He does oh, yeah? not like okay. either of those characters. Okay. and he, you know, So as a result, he is a bit worried about Infiltration. Uh, I didn't speak with Infiltration because he was asleep. <laughs> <laughs> he was taking a nap. Uh, yeah, there, uh -huh, right? you know, was, uh, have a little power nap. Uh, having you know, a very stressful tournament. How do you solve that? Just take a nap. Just take a nap. Honestly, I think that's really good. That I feel like players who can do that, not just even in fighting games, but if you're in some, if you're on the other side of the world and you need to have some big moment coming up, you have a big presentation or something, uh, it's really good to be able to nap. Yeah, it really oh, is. Yeah. And to be able to wake up and perform. And we've seen him do that. We've seen many other players do that as well. It's, it gives people success. A lot of famous pictures of Daigo sleeping on uh, exactly. you know, tables and stuff yeah. outside, yeah. <laughs> outdoor tables. Little hallways. <laughs> yep. So it's going to be our cap as Mise on the first player side, Razor Infiltration on the right. He is going to go with the cap, it looks like. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this is the character that, I mean, really honestly, you know, we joke that he doesn't have any, any main characters because he's played so many different characters. Yeah. But really, Chun-Li and DiCapre, I feel like have been the two main characters that he's gone with. Yeah, today they've done the bulk of the work. Yeah. I mean, he, was, he, he made his name using Akuma, and he right. barely uses Akuma now. He'll, he'll bust it out every once in a while. <laughs> But again, so Makoto not a character with great mobility options, which is why I feel like DiCaprio makes this match so frustrating. Just that the distance control is going to be so tough to deal with. Mm -hmm. Oh, but if he can already get in like this, Mise is already in there. Corner. Oh, crap! Unfortunately for DiCaprio, if she does not have EX meter, she has to choose between hit invincible or throw invincible options. And she just gets wrong there. Mise! And Makoto, just with the ability to stun in just like two combos, such a scary and dangerous character. I did expect a little bit more vagary in terms of movement from Infiltration to Kyber. I feel like that's part of why you picked it, just the ability to go in and out, in and out. And we didn't see a whole lot of that in the first round. Good punish from Infiltration. Ooh, okay. okay. Self save. Yep. Easy dive kick. Confirms into the hard knockdown. Nice. Gets to the other side. Wow. Tried to bait something out. And now Mise looks like content to try to build a little meter. He got a little bit. Let's see if Mise can get back in. That's that's what the match is about, right? It's if Mise can get in. This is the one we've been waiting for. Oh, really? Ooh, he tried to go in there to extend the combo. You can only extend the combo if you FABC the second to last hit. So Misa actually is playing pretty patiently for the most part. Oh, well, he ended up dashing into something there. Oh! See, when he started holding that, that was a great read. Here's Misa now. Two bars, very dangerous. Both go to the air. He's very scared of that. Oh, wow. Spins the meter. Takes him all the way into the corner. Oh! oh. Ultron! We saw him miss that earlier in the day, but this time he lands it. Is it going to be enough to kill? Not quite. Can he stay in? Oh, he thought it was going to do it! It didn't do it! Needs something else! Oh, Mise! Just yeah, gets up. With a deep breath out afterward. Just got right under there with the cross under at the very last second. Just unfortunate for Infiltration, he misjudged that health bar. He was a pixel off, all right? Very close, but look, if you screw up against Makoto, you're, you're gonna lose. That's that's the character. I mean, she she's a tough character to use because it's hard to find openings consistently with her. But if there are mistakes like that, she's better than almost anybody to capitalize on. And I was about to say, infiltration. You know, as we said, lots of different characters, but he's gonna stick with the cap right? And I, I think that's a good choice. It's not like that. You know, he lost that first game really in a bad way. It really was that one misread on the life that cost him. Right. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Mm. He said, tried to backdash myself. Yeah. 
Yeah, me saying you saw it go for that focus. I was thinking air drill as well for the infiltration, but infiltration didn't go for it. I hope you're ready. Let's see if Misa can get anything on this. Nice, just infill. Gets it meaty, so it's safe. Normally punishable. So infiltration staying away looks like. He certainly has a mobile enough character to do that. But we'll see if he can do it for 40 seconds. There's a bunch of time left. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Infiltration just getting away. 30 seconds left on the clock now. Just always looking, just trying to feign that he's doing something. That's why he's throwing out those stand jabs. Keep me say guessing on his rhythm. 20 seconds now. Oh! Oh! Oh, so smart. Dash under. Misei was trying to get ready to block the other direction and just goes for the throw. Ooh! I didn't think he would get charged enough for that. Missed time to that, Midi. Thrown out of Karakusa, let's go. Ooh, here we go. Punish. I tried to dash. No. Oh, okay, you gotta make that happen at some point. Here's me saying now. And just like that, the Capri is away. <laughs> yeah, keeping her in the corner is not the not very easy at all. Oh, here we go. Infiltration just needs a little bit more damage. But so does he say. <laughs> By Makoto standards, okay, but there's the game. I was about to say that he is not he was within the life range that one hit from Makoto could have taken that round anyway. But I think that game went a lot more like how Infiltration wants it to go. There was a lot of extended time of him staying away, being frustrating to catch. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Seemed to pay off. Yeah, exactly. And that's why, like I said, when he went back to DiCapri, I thought that was a really good decision. Because I didn't feel like that first game went super poorly for Infiltration. Now, sometimes people lose and they don't really identify properly why it happened. It's not always the character. Yeah, infiltration right now, even though those little stand jabs that he's throwing out have been so effective. Man, he hides charge really well, right? Ooh, yeah, you don't have to worry about size with the stinger. Oh, patience. Misei was looking for something on Wake Up Dead. Didn't come. Oh, dash up grab. In the ultra. Boom. Misei going to take that first round. Infiltration, of course, one of the heavy favorites coming into this. Yes. But still with the potential to go home. First, yeah, that's right. You first round of the loser bracket in top eight. Losers of this will be tied for seventh. They're all in the money, but drop off from first place is pretty high. He's just really just found a spot. He doesn't seem to be giving in to the chase right now. Not that he's having success over there, really, but I like the fact that he doesn't feel like he needs to chase. Not being frustrated is a big part of this. Oh, he had the efficacy to try to save himself. 60 seconds in and barely any damage for either character. Or 60 seconds left, I should say. Oh, no! Wow, that uh, was so tricky. Oh, nice! Mise now, and then the patience again. Infiltration's wake up stingers have really caused Mise some problems. Oh, no! Oh, hold on! Oh, oh get a up. dash up grab! Oh, my God! That's enough! Yeah, that's wow! That's two to one. With one mistake where he got the stand strong and he canceled on the scramble, normally he should just go into the slide kick and go get the hard knockdown, but for some reason he just canceled into the to the you know reset position. And then he went for the stinger. And a great block for Mise, and he just took the damage, dashed up, grabbed him with the Kadaxa, and right into Ultra. Infiltration looks like he's thinking about it. Let's see if he does stick with DiCaprio. I like the game plan that he has with DiCaprio, and when it's worked, it's worked. Chun Li, oh. that's what he's considering. He's gonna go to his other main character. Were there air quotes there? <laughs> yeah, uh -huh, pretty much. <laughs>
question oh. is, is, is he going to lock in? Please. He did. It's going to wow. be Chun-Li. Oh, so is this is the character that Infiltration is going to let his tournament ride on, because if he loses this game, he's out of here. He's right. Now remember, when, when Nisei fought against Nuktadu, he actually got all those axe kicks over and over again because Guile has to charge for his anti-air. Chun-Li does not have a lot of great anti-airs either, unless she has meter, so... This could be a huge opportunity for Misei just to apply pressure. Yeah, Misei was so worried about the DiCaprio pick, I think you can see why. The other one he was worried about was Elena. He wasn't even... He didn't mention Chun-Li as a, as a character he was afraid of. So far, I think it's looking okay for him. He already has the corner. Oh, wow. But there it is, that EX bird kick. So crucial, but no more meter. Right, and... Oh, no, didn't have bar. Oh, oh wow. and the ultra. that's going to be match point, folks. Our Kappa Mise on the verge of sending Razor Infiltration home, a player a lot of people had getting very high in oh, yeah. early. Very popular pick to take it or get top three. Infiltration loses this. He will go out in seventh place. Yeah, Infiltration is definitely one of the all time greatest Street Fighter 4 players. Okay, he's picked the right spots right now. Yeah, definitely looking very strong this round. Mm, you see a lot of good mobility out of him. Yeah, great spot on screen again. But that's not something that Misei is going to get dissuaded by. You know, he knows, look, he's, he needs to go in. And it doesn't really matter if he has a life deficit right now. All he needs to get in is one, but he never got in what? at all. <laughs> And now Infiltration taking it with a perfect. That's got to be a confidence booster for Infiltration. Mm -hmm. His game plan worked that round, but oh no, here comes. That's so beefy, James. That jump fierce. Chun cannot get hit. Okay, and Infiltration should be safe now from stun. Oh, too far. The range. And no low forward EX. Oh, it just goes for it and gets the hit. Mm. And a trade, a great trade. For me, yeah. Infiltration oh. will he spend it. He does yeah. not yet. And he has doesn't ultra. have the meter, so I felt like he should have spent it right there. Right. That's why I was wondering about it. Mise, can he get in? He really just needs one more hit. Infiltration needs to put up great defense. Oh, now we've got to pull back. All of that space behind him. We've seen how good he is with mobility here, convincing Mise to jump in at the wrong spots. Can Mise find the hole? Oh, no ultra from Infiltration. Oh, oh, that should have been punishable. Infiltration just missed the timing. And Mise knows he has to worry about Ultra 2 jumping in right now, so you see him just staying away from that range. Oh, next hit. Can do it. Again, either side. Oh, he stays in there! Oh, oh no, he went for the axe kick, so with the startup, it gave Infiltration the time to get the jump roundhouse! I think Mise was looking for Wake Up EX Spinning Bird right. in that situation, hence the jump. But, look, Infiltration is, like I said, one of the best Street Fighter Four players of all time, and he had that scouted. He had the counter to the counter. So Infiltration has actually gone back to character select. Of course, he's obligated to stick with the character. But suddenly, if you win, you can't switch. Looks like he's just using the opportunity just to give himself a time to think a little bit, to gather himself. Because that was definitely right there. Yes, very close either way. His Capcom Cup life was just... Yeah. Just flashed right before his eyes. And then he got that jump round now, so he's still in this. One round was a perfect. Can he run that game plan? Ooh! Awesome start for Misei with that uh, whiff option select. Pretty tough to challenge your buttons like that. You really just have to outrange. If you have a better spot. Again, Misei in the last game, he started off the first round just like this. You see, Infiltration has been taken to the air a lot. I mean, that's how he won the last round. He went to the air. I think that's one of those things that Misei might want to scout out. Mm, Misei just wanted that final hit. Did he get too greedy? Okay, no ultra. Oh, only one hit, but Misei did not get caught by that. that... Misei backing off. I like how he does that to a more confident range. It's always interesting that I see Infiltration spend that meter that he could use. Oh, the patience on both sides. Oh, too far. Oh! Oh, the chip! Is that chip? 
That might be. Match point again for our Kappa Mise. That's what it was. Was Chip. Can Infiltration win the two rounds he needs to stay alive? This is the fight we've all has had quite the day. Started off by, hitting, by sending Bone Chan to losers. Another heavy favorite. God, look at the corner carry and the damage on Yo, you can't backdash. Oh, Second there's time. the fill in the corner now. Will he spend it? This time he does. Yes. He hasn't been able to use it all the other times, so this time he says, you know what, I need to spend this. I've been saving it and it hasn't been paying off. Oh, that torch strong from Makoto. Such a good hitbox. Major danger right now for Infiltration. That might be it! It is! Misei takes it! He eliminates Infiltration, one of the heavy favorites. Misei, like I said, beat Bonchan. He's beaten a host of players on his way through. And he's going to keep doing it. That's right. Infiltration's out. Infiltration is out of the tournament in seventh place. Hey, but... Everybody, a big round of applause for Infiltration, one of the greatest Street Fighter 4 players of all time.